the smart removal out function optimizes the removal process, having the robot exit the mold while holding the part. Have the program highlighted to the line that the smart removal function out should occur. Select the smart removal function icon. Make sure that you select move out. And the movement properties will determine which axis moves first. The drop down will allow you to choose the X axis for a horizontal mount robot or the Z axis for a L mount robot. Normally, the second axis will be the Y axis ascending out of the mold. The position above the mold is the position the robot should reach when it's completely out of the mold. The current position will show where it is currently in the mold. Select set and drive the robot to the position that you want to attain out of the mold. and select OK to insert. Do the same thing for the Y axis. Drive the robot up out of the mold to the position it should attain and select OK. The straight movement from the takeout position allows the X to move away from the ejectors while holding the part before the Y axis begins its ascent up out of the mold. This is a relative distance from the position that the smart removal has it in when it's receiving the part. Select the dialog box and input the relative distance you want X to travel away from the ejectors while holding the parts before Y ascends up. Set permission for mold close before the mold safety switch will be reached, optimizes and reduces the signal transfer time, allowing the mold to more efficiently close. It is important that your mold safety switches are set to the appropriate position based on the size of the end of arm tool. This will allow the signal transfer for mold close to occur as we are traveling towards the mold safety switch. Select insert and your smart removal function out will be placed in the program, showing the position the robot will arrive at when it's completely out of the mold the delta x, the straight movement away from the uh, position in the mold to receive the part, and the delta t is the amount of time prior to reaching the mold safety switch on the y axis to allow the permission for mold to close.